Hey guys, Lex here with another video. So this is another uh, unboxing and first impressions video. So I'm quite glad I got a series because it means I'm um, no dressing up, no suit or anything. I can just buy something or get a sample and just talk about it there and then just see what the first thing that comes to my mind. So I was um, quite enjoying this series. Now I know I've done some samples last time. Today I'm going to go, uh, talk about friends I got today. This is Moogler Cologne by Terry Moogler. And I got this at Debenham, so a really good price. And um, what well, normally retails at £31 for the 100ml, which is already a great price. That's a full price. The cot was 10% off. Uh, phone going. Cot's 10% off. And um, it was down to 27 and I had £15 in spot points to spend. So I ended up getting it for 12 quid, so I can't complain for 100ml. So, nice enough box. You know, Moogler Cologne there, Terry Moogler. All Moogler stuff's quite classy, quite nice. So, let's see. Open it up here. Some packaging. The lid's part here. There it is. Ah, yeah. So, yeah, there's a box. Put that there for now. Uh, yeah, here's a bottle there. If you look, quite a nice bottle. Looks like it's got a chip in it, style wise. It's quite cool here. So, uh, and also another thing to mention is um, I'll take the lid off here. It's got a wee protective lid. It's also a splasher spray. You can unscrew this part here uh, and take off the atomizer and use it as a splash, which is cool. So, can't complain. Okay, I like CK Shock and Aqua Fahrenheit, you can do that. Yeah, so um, yeah, nice enough, cool bottle, I love holding it, it just looks awesome. Sort of the black sheep in the middle of the line, but it's still really good. So let's talk about what I get from this. So let's uh, have a spray here. Mmm. I like the plastic caps, not really too cheap. It has a logo on it as well, which is cool, so. Mmm. Very, very fresh vetiver, you know. It's not like Enquinoir or Galene's vetiver, but it's dark and earthy and rough and rugged and manly. This one's very fresh. Very, very nice. Soapy, you know. Clean. Just an overall clean, soapy, very nice scent. Really, really good stuff. Really enjoying it. Awesome. So, yeah, I mean, for 12 quid, I'm really looking forward to wearing this when the weather gets better. This is, like, good for be my go-to summer scent. Along with Invictus. I don't know if you will say it, but Invictus is a proud pleaser, but I draw away this personally. But man, this stuff is great. Uh, my friend Ross actually pointed out, he sniffed this, gave him some, and he mentioned that it was um, like leaves, you know what, mine, there's wet leaves in the ground. That's it, I agree, that's what it sort of smells like. You know what, mine, there's sort of wet leaves and stuff, and it goes to more woody when it dries down. He's, he's actually got an excellent nose, his nose is a lot better than mine, so he picks out a lot of good stuff. And it's true, this stuff's really just clean, and it's just clean all the way through, it's great. On initial spray till it, when it finally dies out, it's just awesome. Last and pillar so far, this is sort of moderate projection, moderate longevity. Um, can't really complain, it, it does sort of shine in warmer weather, you see, so... Yeah, not that we get much warmer weather in here in Scotland, so... Yeah, just a cool bottle. I love holding this bottle, I just love it, look at it. I love holding this bottle, it's awesome, so I'm really, really glad to have this. For sure. Awesome stuff. So uh, yeah, I'm looking forward to wearing this. It's just a really fresh, clean soapy scent. I know a lot of people compare this scent to Creed's, Creed's original vetiver. Uh, again, um, as Creed's original vetiver is a better scent, but you do pay for it 200 pounds a bottle, so uh, you can see. <laughs> but this one, um, yeah, this one came out first. This came out in 2001, I believe. Original vetiver, I think, came out in 2003, 2004. So this is the original one. Yeah. Uh, could do that quite a lot, they take it as an original fragrance like XS or anything. Uh, um, Chanel's Platinum Eagles and they make an improved version of it. Uh, which isn't too bad because I know like Polo Green is technically an improved version of Givenchy Gentleman. I personally think Givenchy Gentleman's better but that's just me. So yeah, um, really really good scent. A lot of people don't like it though. Sort of black sheep of the Moogler house to some people. But um, really, I think it's a great scent. Honestly, I think uh, it deserves a bit of respect. Um, really, really good, and for the price, I mean, even at full price, £31 RRP, £31 for a 100ml bottle, that's out of shop RRP, and for a TA Moodle scent, that's pretty damn good. For the quality of scent you get, it's a very, very fresh, very nice scent, very clean. For the quality of scent you get, uh, um, you know, you can't really complain. So this one's great. Really, really like this one so far. Just awesome, awesome stuff. So yeah, guys, um, and that's some sort of first impression of what I get from Moogle Cologne. This is just a short video, um, not a longest like the rest of them. But um, yeah, so anyway, thank you for watching, guys. Uh, any questions you have about this scent, feel free to send me a message or leave a comment below. 
if you enjoyed this video and would like to see more don't forget to like subscribe and share with your friends thank you to everyone who has subscribed the reason I keep doing these videos uh, if you want to see more of these videos don't forget to click on my channel click on playlists click on fragrance unboxing and first impressions and all the videos in that series will be listed there you can also google my name followed by the series or video you want to see and uh, google should find the playlist of video for you easily the song I use in the intro will also be in the, the description along with a link to my blog so yeah guys um, this is a short video today on Moogle's Cologne by Terry Moogle, released in 2001. Excellent scent. This is the latest formulation, by the way, just as I mentioned. So, um, yeah, guys, thank you for watching and have a nice day.